Hello and welcome back to the Sovereign FX YouTube channel. So today we're gonna go over a strategy that has ultimately around 80% win rate and it's for scalpers. I realized that I've shared strategies that most of you can't apply. Maybe you can't, but it's not easy due to emotions and what's not but using this strategy you can eliminate emotions by simply looking at this indicator so without further ado let me show you how to set up this indicator and just by a glance you can see how profitable it is okay so here sell here buy okay but let me go over the settings okay so let me first get rid of the indicator here's the indicator just move to your indicator section in your trading view type arun select the first one move to your settings okay so in the style arun up is simply buys and arun down is sells as you can see so we want our arun down to be red and our arun up to be green this is basically the conventional way of referring to buys and sells so we're going to back test this with you guys so that you can see how profitable it is and as a rule of thumb always have a one to three risk to reward okay so even when you hit a losing streak two trades can get you out of the drawdown okay so here we have so you can couple this with your strategy, support and resistance, supply and demand. Any strategy you want, you can couple this and have it as an extra confirmation. Okay, as of here, this is what you have. Let me use uh, support. But you can just enter based on the crosses and the crossovers. But let me use support so that most of you can understand because... I know most of you use this strategy so as you can see it's giving us a sell but you're not sure where to execute so you can execute immediately after or you can wait for a retest of the highs or a break of the lows okay so we'd have a short position so if you've gone over my previous videos here's how i enter price makes a low pulls back then we look to retest the low so as price made the high made the low i mean sorry then pulls back here's where our entry would be our stop loss just above the previous 30 minute candle as usual then we're going to use a one to three risk to reward okay so here's our first trade notice how we didn't enter here but later so this is how I have incorporated it to my own strategy. But you can just use it flatline like nothing else on the charts, only a run. And you'll see you'll still be profitable. But I like this better since I was also used to support and resistance. So here, if you had a $10,000 account, you risked $1,000, made $3,000, easy money. And as also a rule of thumb, only take one to two trades a day. Don't be greedy because greed doesn't allow you to see the markets using your clear eyes so what i do after i take such a trade just step away from the markets take an hour that that is just my personal way of trading you have to take an hour away from the markets so that you can have your emotions at bay so this was our first trade you can also use this as a scalper you can always have a one-to-one -one risk to reward. Get into the market, throw your jobs at the market, get your small profit, go home happy. So as you can see, here it tells us to buy. Notice how this is the 30 minute time frame. The higher you go on the time frames, the accurate it becomes, but the slower or the more patience you'd have to have so that you can watch a trade solidify. So I prefer the 30 minutes as an intermediate between the hourly 
and the four hours and the lower time frame like the 15 minute and the five minutes okay so let us look at this by scalps as i have told you okay let me just use lines lines are much easier but always remember support and resistance are not always lines but a collection of prices around this area so this is what it looked like it gave us a buy okay price closed above long position a one to three so you see in this scenario price didn't actually give us a one to three but as my rules go when price hits a one to one i move my stop loss to break even therefore i have nothing to lose the price didn't hit my take profit of one to three but there's always there's always more trades in the market there's always another setup there's always another form of entry you'll get so don't get mad or try to force a trade you see most of us when trading you can sit in the charts for hours and hours and feel like you've wasted time and the market has to reward you so doing that forces you into a trade where you lose okay sometimes not having a position is a position in itself so i think so how would we have caught this bull run so look at this it told us to take our buys around this area okay so having our minor resistance and our minor support so after it tells us buy we only wait for a closure above our support so as you can see price closed above but we didn't have a signal to enter so price pulled back then closed above again and immediately it closed above the indicator told us get in here so this is how i'd have entered so a long position stop loss below here for around 30 pips take profit always a one to three so as you can see this trade over here so it's so simple i i try my best to explain it so if you have any questions you could leave it in the comment section below but i find this so simple this is the easiest strategy you can have and as i've told you you don't always need support and resistance you can always just capitalize on immediately it crosses over enter your trade have your but this will have your stop loss wider because you'll have it below the previous zones and take profit around one to three all right so with that i think i'd come to the end of this video but as you can see also we could have capitalized on this whole bearish move simply why because it flipped red caught this whole move swung it down and you can also use it as an exit indicator if you are already in a position as it flips or crosses over exit the position this is this is telling you that market is shifting towards the opposite of your bias okay so make sure to leave a like comment subscribe you could join our telegram groups our free telegram groups follow me on instagram if you have any questions you can contact me on any social media as sovereign effects see you next time